And folks, we are keeping an eye for news out of Ren Lake College. We told you we're expecting some kind of announcement there. We're going to try to turn things over to News 3's Paul Wilcoxon again, who is meeting with an organizer. Paul, what have you got for us tonight? Yeah, to Julie, this is a huge announcement here for the Rin Lake College. I'm see, I'm here with uh, Don Johnson. Don Johnson, she's with the RLC Foundation. She was here for this announcement here. Banterra Center has made the largest donation this college has ever had. Talk me, tell me a little bit about it. We are so excited. This is huge for Rin Lake um, athletics and campus as well, and we are just so grateful for this partnership. Now, this uh, the the donation is a naming rights. So it's a one million dollars. Talk a little bit about what this project kind of goes to. Sure. It's been over 55 years since Jim Wad Gymnasium has had any significant renovations, and it is time. And not only for our future athletes, um, our current athletes, and our gymnasium is actually the most used building on campus at Ren Lake. So what is this project you hopefully will say to the community, to those future students, uh, the, the commitment that this college has? Sure. Well, it obviously aids in our recruitment efforts, but we are also home to the junior high state games, which host over 56 games a year. So when we say community college, it truly is a community effort. Yeah, definitely. So I will have more coming up tonight on News 3 at 10. More about this information. I'll have some more comments from other people as well. But I'm going to send it back to the studio with weather with Katie Melvin.